Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Tops Inception Baseball. 16 bucks, pick a team number 9. Big thanks to all these folks for getting into the action. Really appreciate it. Shook up the toner a little bit here. So Edwin with the Royals. Last spot mojo. No Cardinals in the picker teams. They only have base cards, so we didn't sell them. At the end of the break, if there's any Cardinals cards, we'll randomize it to one person in the break. All right. There is the case right here. Let's pop this baby open. Let's see what we got. We have not seen a book yet, ladies and gentlemen. I know they're, they're few and far between, but I'm hoping. If we see a book, it's going to be pretty sick, I think. It's going to be pretty awesome. This, is, this, this unboxing is not awesome. Look at this. It's poor. This is very poor. <laughs> All right. Yeah, Cameron, if it sells out, I'll break it. Not sold out yet, though. All right, so there's eight on the left side, eight on the right side. Unless it's sold out, like, like in, in the last two minutes. Of, no, still eight teams left. So that is up to the whole crew if they want to break that tonight. All right, good luck, everybody. That would be Teddy. Teddy's on the Instagram stream right now. Yeah. This is about a 30-minute break, 20, 20, 30 minute break. So if you want to do something, do a personal break, you can go to the Instagram stream at Jaspie's Breaks. Info in the chat. All right. We got Aaron Saval to 150. And behind, oh, is there another base card here? Yeah, there, there's Dustin May. And behind Pete is Austin Nola. Nice. At a 245. Mariners, Joe Andreessen. And apologies if it sounds like I have a marble in my mouth, which is because I do. No, it's, it's a throat lozenge. The voice is starting to go. Everyone's been keeping me busy all week. Which we appreciate, of course. In these in these odd times that we live in. It's COVID times. All right. There's a uh, Willie Castro to 50. And there's a Cardinal card right here, so we'll set that right there to remind me to randomize that. And kaboom, Carter Keyboom, 32 out of 245 for Evan and the Nats. It's pretty nice. I guess I could just, if to preserve my voice, because I could just whisper the entire break. Should I just ASMR the entire break? Cody Bellinger. <laughs> Would that be a new thing? ASMR breaks and just hear the... There's Nico Herner on card autograph, 18 out of 245, EA with the Cubs. I feel like the I feel like this would get annoying. That's not very ASMR, -y, right? Not the way I open packs. In a swift, clean, and efficient manner. It would be opened way too slow. I like the sound of that though. <laughs> Jeff, that, that would be such a mean thing to do. Jeff Anderson's like, and then do do ASMR breaks. And then when there's a hit, announce it like they scored a goal in soccer. So it, it would just be like, it'd be like really quiet. And it'd be like, goal! What a hit! Just blow out the eardrums of anybody who's listening on headphones. 
I would think we would get some very um, strongly worded emails emailed to us here at Jaspies if we did that. Here's Will Smith. Will Smith, what? <laughs> and I can just go to the complete other opposite extreme and do what do what the let's say overly, enth overly enthusiastic breakers. We'll get like a card number to 150. I'm like, what? Cody Bellinger to 150. Wow. That's amazing. What an amazing card, guys. I was running out of these. Ladies and gentlemen, what is your, uh, for those of you watching right now, we've got about almost 50 people on. What is your favorite, uh, your favorite non-musical sound? Your favorite non-musical sound. There's Jake Rogers to 150. Could be the sound of rain. Could be the sound of your feet on, on gravel. Could be the sound of a pack being opened up. I do like the sound of this. The shuffling of cards, especially of this kind of stock. Chris Paddock and Aaron Saval to 75. Jeff Anderson saying water. That's a good one. A sound of running water, a babbling brook, a creek, oh, some crashing waves. Yeah, Jeff Anderson, a money counting machine. I'm with you. That's a good sound. Uh, Aaron Saval goes to Greg and the Indians. There you go, Greg. The sound of me saying your name in a group break. That's a good non-musical sound. I do like this too, Gilo. It's a good sound. The crack of the sticker on the back of a... I know there's a tops break, but at the back of a Panini National Treasures box, that's a good one. It's Josh Hader to 99. Yeah, it's kind of ASMR. I mean, we can't go full ASMR. I think that would be a little too much. There's Nick Solak to 99, but there are those sort of elements in group breaks, I think. I think there is elements of that. You know, like you can hear like the crackle of the, 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 the slicing of a box, the crackle of a pack. You know. Nick Solak going to the, the Rangers, Patrick Evans. You know, or if it's like a like a Bowman draft break, the shuffling of cards or something like that. There is that sort of element there. In addition to all these visual elements that we get. There you go. Jeff Anderson loves the click of a one touch on a nice hit. There's Kyle Lewis to one fifty, Mariners. Mauricio Dubon and Brennan Rogers to 245. Rockies, Rick Butler. And the next box, halfway through this pick your team, folks. Pick your team number nine. And there's Mike Talkman. Is that 69? Nice. Out of 75, <laughs> we're 12. Uh, Edward, 
with the Yankees. Next box. I saw a nice patch auto in there. Let's see who it's for, what team it's for. Behind Bo Bichette is Tim Anderson. Two-color jersey and autograph. White Sox, Michael K. <laughs> Come on, dude. It's a family show. Your family show. Your face is a family show. That's out of 25. Tim Anderson starting a new... Uh, I think he started an Instagram. I don't know what, what kind of content he's delivering, but saw that on an interview, a podcast. There's a podcast... What, what, what? It's on YouTube. It's some guy with uh, CC Sabathia doing like a video podcast sort of thing. But they've got they got a couple good interviews with him, with them, and Tim Anderson, and them and like Trevor Bauer and Sonny Gray. There's Aristides Aquino to one fifty. Whenever the whenever Jaspies is not on, that's probably something to, to to look at. And we got Josh Naylor, seventy nine out of ninety. Jeremy thirty three with the Padres. That's a that's a case hit, Jeremy. I think there's these only fall one per case. Next box. Chris Nielich, 99. When I get a chance to watch the baby version of the first take, like the show first take, but with babies, it's intriguing. There's Josh Bell. Patch Auto is Ronald Acuna Jr. 131 out of 155. Richard Dunn with the Braves. Next box. Behind Justin Verlander is Keston Hira. At a 99, we pulled the one of one in a previous break, I think, a couple breaks ago. It's a nice, still a nice one, though, for the Brewers. Colton. There you go, man. Sorry, Colton. I realized you didn't want to hear that. <laughs> I still got you one, though. All right. No, it's all good, Trendsetter. Sometimes those videos get kind of text-heavy when you're when, when it's all listed out. Jose Ramirez reveals a Bo Bichette two-color patch and autograph, 112 out of 155. Dylan Short, Blue Jays, nice Bo Bichette. YouTube has a uh, the YouTube chat has some automated uh, features. Just be pulling the curtain behind the curtain has some automated features where it'll flag some posts that have certain words right there, right? Or when people think they're when it thinks they're certain words, 
more often than not, when someone's talking about Bo Bichette, and they type that into the chat, even if they spell it right, it'll flag it. It'll hold it for a review, which is kind of funny. It's not a household name yet. Anthony Rizzo to 25. And behind Domingo Leiba is his uh, is him. I was going to say his teammate, but no, that's him. It's him. Behind the guy. He's the guy behind the guy behind the guy. Andy Owens with that auto. All right, two boxes to go. Thanks for hanging out with us all week long, folks. I know it's been a busy week because uh, because my voice is going. That's how I know you you guys have kept me busy. I say this every week. More weeks, more Saturdays than not, I say that, which is probably a good thing. Here's Goldie. I'll be randomized to one person in the break. Zach Gallen reveals another patch auto. Royals this time. Josh Stomont, 52 out of 75. Edwin with the Royals. Last spot mojo strikes again. Ooh, Reggie Jackson just got a hold of one. Wow. Man. What a hit. The Yankees are up 5-2 in the AL East tiebreaker, top of the eighth. I don't know what happens. <laughs> so this is like a new game to me. Jose Ramirez to 75. Jacob deGrom reveals a Austin Riley. 16 out of 50. Nice finish. Richard with the Braves. And there you have it, boys and girls. That was Pick Your Team number 9 from jazbeescasebreaks.com. I didn't see too many cases left in the back. So when you see a break, go and get it. Now, let's see who gets those Cardinals cards. So let's uh, grab some new dice, some new teams. Yeah, Rex, Rex, Rex sees a little potential in, uh, in Reggie Jackson. He thinks he'll stick around. Welcome to Group Breaks in 1978, ladies and gentlemen. It's late September in 1978. Let's roll it and randomize it. Six and a four at ten times. One, two, three, four, five. In fact, Teddy's playing some uh, Rocky One music right now. It could be 1978. Five, ten, right? Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Yeah, six and a four. Ten times. After ten times, uh, Greg, you'll get those extra Cardinals cards. There you have it, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.